Hello, I'm Brandon with Mel Parser, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to convert email to REST API. To get started, the first thing you'll need to do is create an inbox. You'll need to create an inbox name, assign a category, and add any notes if you'd like. Next, you'll be presented with a private mail parser email that you'll be instructed to send emails to. Mail parser recommends forwarding at least two example emails of the same type to the email address shown on the screen. This can be done in whatever email service provider. After sending your email successfully, mail parser will notify you of the emails received. You can now add parsing rules to tell the algorithm what kind of data fields to pull from your emails and isolate the data you want to export. For a how-to on how to create parsing rules, click the annotation in the upper right-hand corner of this video. The next step is to send the data as an HTTP request to any URL. This can be done by creating a webhook dispatcher and then entering the URL of where the script is located. To begin, Navigate to your mail parser inbox and choose the generic webhook option from the integrations page. On the next screen, you'll be presented with various options. These options include the following. Inputting your endpoints URL, choosing the payload format, configuring the repeating data behavior, the data structure fields, and any additional headers needed to make the connection. And lastly, you can send data in JSON, XML, or form data formats to any endpoint on the web capable of receiving these types of payloads. Adding custom headers for authentication supports JSON, XML, form fields, and more. And if you have any questions about this functionality, please don't hesitate to reach us at support at mailparser.com.